Welcome to the 3D Experience platform. Experience another way to manage capital projects from construction planning preparation to construction execution in the field. The Compass provides access to all applications needed to execute projects. Users can add preferred applications to their favorites for their daily work tasks. The platform will help you collaborate efficiently to master and control project schedules and avoid delays. Project stakeholders can access customized applications and widgets that aggregate information in the overall 3D dashboard. As a project manager, you can build your personal dashboard organized in multiple tabs. The Project tab displays a 360-degree view of the project, aggregating multiple reports with information coming from the platform and from external systems as well. The Engineering tab allows you to aggregate project dashboards related to the engineering deliverable plan, enabling an alert for any deviation in delivery scheduling. Construction tab targets complex and long-term projects in the field. It provides construction execution insights with task summary status and graphic comparison of project completion versus plan. A 3D widget displays the plant model and enables review of the construction sequences. Let's drill down into the 3D virtual plant in order to analyze in detail how the construction sequence is planned and optimized. For engineering, procurement, and construction companies, minimizing the project schedule is crucial since it directly impacts project profits. Reducing construction execution time helps to improve competitiveness in the market. Multi-D technology and optimized plant construction solutions both focus on this critical stage with time-based 3D modeling and much more. In traditional practices, planners had to check constructability and then estimate tasks durations and the resources required for each work package in order to balance the erection sequences or to plan resource availability, for example. Optimization was difficult or nearly impossible. Thanks to the 3D Experience platform, the plant design model, the construction process, and resources are integrated and interconnected. Based on a standard process library and norms, the construction phases are simulated on the 3D virtual model of the target plant, delivering precise information on required duration and resources. Once sequencing is decided, the schedule is displayed in a Gantt chart, and an animation shows in 3D how the plant will be built up. You can check whether resource conflicts occur and balance and optimize the workload. Constructability can also be simulated in detail for complex and critical construction processes. Installation paths can be simulated, while interferences are dynamically checked with the surrounding structure, piping, or other equipment. Workers' tasks can also be simulated and evaluated with mannequins. Finally, you can compare multiple scenarios and choose the most optimized alternative. From the construction schedule perspective, purchase orders can be done with precise timing, Everything can be planned just in time across engineering, procurement, and construction, resulting in time and cost savings. In order to achieve project excellence, the actual progress of each phase is monitored within the 3D Experience platform, where all schedules across engineering, procurement, and construction are integrated. If you are a construction manager, you have your plan for each of your construction tasks but you won't be able to execute it if required materials are not ready at the site or the design is not finalized. In Unified Schedule, you can see all those dependencies visually. For your construction tasks, if any dependent engineering or procurement tasks are behind schedule, you will see the markers turn red. Now we are focusing on a task to install equipment. You see the detail of this equipment item in the pane below. Now let's see how this equipment item is delivered to the site. Before we had the 3D Experience platform, field people received work orders in paper form and needed to gather information from the central file managed by document controllers. 
With the 3D Experience platform, all work orders are dispatched in electronic format and all information needed to understand the work is associated with it. Here I am an inspector, and I receive a work request for receiving inspection of the SG, the steam generator, which is to be installed in two weeks. I found damages on the SG. Probably this SG was dropped during transport. I should immediately report my findings from my visual inspection. I select an appropriate view of the model, pick the point where I found the damage, and describe the finding. It will now be noted on the 3D dashboard. Back to the 3D Experience platform, the non-conformance report issued by the inspector in the field is immediately available in the 3D Dashboard Quality Control tab. The SG being delivered with damages will obviously impact the overall construction schedule. The decision needs to be made whether to repair the SG or to order a new one to be fabricated. Collective knowledge is leveraged from the best experts in the company. World-class engineering, procurement, and construction companies have active communities for various subjects. Subject Matter Experts, SME, are expected to contribute and to educate members in the company with posts or articles, but also they are expected to support or help any project with their expertise. It is not just as volunteers. They are evaluated based on their contributions. For example, if a project requests help from subject matter experts, they are obliged to answer in two days. People know there must be an answer, so the community becomes more active. In this case, the SG was damaged. There is a specific topic called fitness for service, which means whether we can use it or not. This community consists of various experts in areas such as fracture mechanics, stress analysis, welding, metallurgy, etc. We describe the detail of our project in an I question, and the experts give their advice from various points of view. Unfortunately, the conclusion is that this SG cannot be used anymore and it needs to be refabricated. New SG delivery takes more than one year, so in order to minimize the impact, the construction schedule needs to be changed. In today's nuclear power plant construction, Open-top methodology is often applied to reduce the construction schedule, and that is applied for this project as well. Here you install all major equipment items, piping, and structures in modules into the reactor container, building through the open top, and then put on and close the roof at the end of the sequence using a very heavy lifting crane. Typical steam generator delivery takes more than one year, which means if we follow the original sequence, we cannot close the roof in the following year. However, we found that the steam generators could be brought inside the container building through the maintenance opening at the bottom of the building, using the polar crane installed inside the building. If this works, we can proceed with all the other work, except the steam generators, without waiting for their refabrication, and close the roof as originally planned. We simulate all the sequences of the recovery plan, collision-free carry-in path, operation of the polar cranes, piping tie-in, workers access, and so on in the 3D Experience platform, and confirm that with the recovery plan, the impact on the construction schedule is zero. Now the recovery plan is created by the construction planners. However, field work to perform the recovery plan has become more complex. The construction plan in Multi-D is published as work instructions, and field workers can access the instructions provided with clear and understandable visuals on mobile devices. Associated documents are delivered together with the work instructions. A field welding operation has to be done at the bottom of the SG. And with no more surprises, the weld is attached with the instruction in order to show how to get access to the seam.